Hey guys, Lampfenanity here again today with episode 8 of Let's Build an Inform Team. And as you know, last week I got Inform Valbuena, but after that another right winger was released in the newest top of the week team, which is Hatem Ben Arfer, and I decided to get him as I promised in the comment section. 83 overall rated player, plays for Newcastle United in the Barclays Premier League, and he's from France. 86 in pace, 82 in shooting and 88 dribbling on his card. Some really nice in-game stats as always. 92 agility, 70 in strength which is quite surprisingly high actually for a good dribbler and a winger. Usually they are a lot weaker. 81 vision, 84 in curve, 85 finishing, 85 free kick accuracy, 87 long shot as well as shot power. Only downside of him is in my opinion that he's an injury prone so he will be injured quite a lot I think as a dribbler there but 5 star skill moves, 4 star weak foot ability can't complain about him at all so now here I'm searching for him as a right winger his price increased quite a lot over the last few days look for him here in the 4-3-2-1 formation and there are two I'm interested in here one for 120,000 coins this one for 116,000 and some of you complained that, yeah, well, I didn't bid on players, but yeah, just bought them now, which uh, was a higher price, of course. But um, with this one, I actually, after thinking it through a little bit, decide to place a bid on this Hatman Alpha for 109,000 coins. And I just try the best with that and wait if I get him. In the meantime, I check for the other Ben Arthur and just put him on my watch list in case the other one is bought by another person. But here you can see the last 5 seconds of Ben Arthur being on the market. And finally... I get him for 109,000 coins, pretty good deal actually, really good player, put him in my squad and now move into the striker of our squad which is going to be Robin van Persie, you all know him, the 87 version of him, he plays for Arsenal London in the Barclays Premier League and is from the Netherlands, 87 overall rated as I just said, 81 pace, 91 shooting on his card, also 81 passing which is nice for a striker. 87 in dribbling, in-game 85 agility, 88 positioning, 93 ball control as well as curve, 98 finishing which is crazy, also 86 free kick accuracy, really good free kick taker as well in game, 94 long shots, 97 in shot power, also 89 short passing which is as I said phenomenal for a striker in my opinion, 4 star skill moves, 4 star weak foot ability, absolutely can't go wrong with him, he costs quite a lot, but I think he's definitely worth it. On the downside again, the only one probably that he is injury prone just as Ben Arfa. So might get injured quite often too. There's also an 88 rated version but this costs over 400,000 coins which would be too expensive at the moment. So now here I'm searching for him and even the normal version goes for quite a lot. So um, look for him in the 4-3-2-1 formation, there's no one in the price range I'm interested in. Two of them are on the market, one for 255,000 and the other for 256,000. 47 contracts on this one. And um, I um, don't know what I'm actually doing here, thinking it a little bit through. After some time, I can't really tell you why I got this one, to be honest, but um, well, I just get this one for 255,000 coins, which is quite a lot, but again, he is an absolutely amazing player. Always wanted to try him out. So now, again, I needed to get a formation card for him. And this is sped up a little bit here again and uh, 
get this one for 2600 coins which is quite okay in my opinion again as I said before another video 4321 cards are probably the most expensive non shiny formation cards now put Ben Alpha in the right wing position put Balbuena on the bench and put Van Persie into his striker position and quickly apply the formation card to him to get the best chemistry possible out of him also quite a nice little link up between Ben Alpha and Van Persie there so now this is uh, yeah actually the full squad then I decided the chemistry isn't too high of course because I got a bunch of random players in there so I decided to put in a manager only one in the 4-3-2-1 formation is Joachim Löw who puts up the chemistry to 83 but then I think I can get better chemistry of course with a Brazilian manager because I have three Brazilian players in there looking here for a manager formation card because I know I already have a Brazilian manager in my squad or in my club as I should better say and after a while I find one for 600 coins which is pretty okay in my opinion now again moving back to the squad and swapping the managers out to get a better chemistry Here's my Brazilian manager, usually in the, here in the 4-2-2-2 formation, but I apply the consumable to him, which moves him to a 4-3-2-1 manager, which bumps up my chemistry to 86. <coughs> Sorry. So the squad is now complete with Shea Given, Marcelo, Naldo, Bruno, Alves, Johnson, Belanda, Kagawa, Dani, Ben Arfa, Nene, and Robin Van Persie. Also Valbuena now on the bench too. In total so far we spent 978,300 coins and I just wanted to say that substitutes I will get, I will of course get inform players for that but these will be just yeah, rather cheap inform players around maybe 20,000 coins so I'm thinking about splitting that in maybe two episodes or even one episode if I can save up the money for that. So please leave your opinions in the comment section below if I should talk about them in detail as well or just so show you how I bought them. And yeah, basically then the series will already be finished guys. After that I will probably play a couple of games with this squad, pretty excited to play with them. Maybe I can play against someone of you who can record it so I can upload you know, a little gameplay video talking about the squad, what I liked, what I didn't like about them. And after that I will probably yeah, sell almost the entire squad again, see how much money I can make from them back again. And because I have plans for another squad I want to build. So I hope you enjoyed this video guys, this was the last player for our starting 11 squad. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did so, please hit the like button, that helps me out a lot. You gave me awesome feedback over the last couple of videos, it's just incredible. Yeah, you can also follow me on Twitter as usual, link is in the description, it's at lamfan 2 there. And thanks for watching guys, this was a, quite a long video but I hope you continued watching it until now. Thanks for watching again and I'll see you later guys.